the car industry is not a digital business at the moment. So, but what we are seeing from a customer perspective, um, one hand is that there are trends in certain areas in the world where, let's say, owning a car is not anymore that big status symbol as it has been some decades ago. It's more sexy to then just only use a car instead of owning it. This is something we are seeing increasingly more and more in different areas. And I think therefore we are also trying to identify the new strategy for BMW. This is one side. The other side is that we are also seeing new competitors coming into the markets. And with the help of digitization of the society, there are also new opportunities for us. So it was impossible to do some years ago to open your car with your smartphone. And now with digitization of society and infrastructure, there are totally also new opportunities for us as BMW. Well, the digital strategy of BMW um, is an um, overall company approach. So there's no digital company in the company of BMW. So the board and we as a company decided that the whole company is becoming more and more a tech company in terms of, let's say, products. So our cars will be driving autonomously sometime soon. Our products are more and more digital services. So we have apps, so you can integrate our products also into your smart home, for instance. And let's say the enabler and the backbone of this transformation is that also our, let's say, processes are adopting the digital era and also our, let's say, production lines and, and plants are becoming more and more digital because there you can also use, for instance, data to be more precise in production-wise. BMW can learn a lot from digital companies, of course mainly on product side, but also on the way a company is working. So for instance processes, so that it's okay to fail mentality. So this is something which we are learning now, So and also we are accepting it now. And I think digital companies are very good in be agile to come up with products very soon and then let them test it by customers and not just only do it with 100% uh, let's say accuracy. This is still valid for cars but I think for digital services it's better to think like a startup and act like a grown-up. The internet for BMW is of importance so I think on many different entities. So I think the first initial one was back in the 90s where we integrated for the first time internet inside the car. So for our customers. So you was able to then Google inside your car. I think this was some years ago. And now internet, I think um, if you define internet as let's say technology that enables you to send and receive data, I think it is the core of the company even as of today because um, all production lines are steered with data, all, let's say, communications with customers and prospects are more and more on digital um, interfaces and digital channels. And of course, internet itself will also evolve for BMW, also from business perspective, because we are also more and more into internet sales, so you can sometimes soon globally buy cars online via the internet. And, uh, and I think now it's more kind of communication channel for customers mainly. This is one thing. The other thing is that social media is also a crucial part of our communication strategy because we are seeing a lot of fans on Facebook that are liking BMW, that are tweeting about BMW, that are uploading pictures on Instagram with the hashtag BMW. I think it's a very good opportunity for us as a company. The industries from a consumer products to automobile to banking are comparable on a branding level. Of course, also Julius Baer and BMW are premium brands. And of course, we want to build a community and communicate a specific brand image. So therefore, I think branding is a core topic. I think the contrast between chocolate bar companies and a company that is selling cars is 
We're offering products with long decision making processes. So it's not enough to just only have one flight of TV commercials and then you will see an, an uplift in sales like with chocolate bars um, probably um, is. Um, with cars I think this is a long journey with our customers and it's a huge invest into the brand to then also let's say support the decision of the customers based on the brand values of for instance BMW or of Mini.